All right. So, as many people are aware, uh, the back rooms were recently found uh, in real life. People tracked it down, and it got me curious to get back into checking out some of the various back room type videos. Uh, one of the ones I had wish listed was pools. Um, I think that's a level, what was it, level 37? Is that level 37 of the back rooms? Anyways, I don't know a whole lot of the lore. I'm not as invested in it as others, but I ended up buying this game simply because it reminds all of us of various dreams we've had or places we might have seen. So, that being said, it looks like pools has maybe like six parts I'm not sure but of course we're gonna go into uh, part one here if it is six I'll probably end up doing six different videos cuz I'm not much for doing long ones that being said uh, let's dive in okay sounds like a ladder or a grate or something Like I've landed. Did we fall? I'm guessing we fell. Interesting. Sorry, getting my uh, my my uh <laughs> my my surroundings here. This is uh quite interesting. Not well lit. What's up with this chair? Oh my gosh, I can sit down. Okay, my boy having a rest. I guess it's slightly interactive. Cool that it's a plastic chair though. The ambience in this is, uh, ah, hell no. <laughs> I am not fond of places that are dark. Like, in real life, eh, maybe not such a big deal, but this is the back rooms. Um, yeah, there's absolutely no way. I don't know how. How did you manage to fall? Or were you just Captain Curious and jumped down here? I'll never know. Guess we'll head to this room. Okay, this is cool. Kind of like a little kiddie pool. This is cool. Well lit, kind of nice and inviting. Ooh. Splish splash, splish splash. Caution, slippery floor. Uh, oh, what? The hell? Oh, I'm going to regret this. I'm going to regret this. And no, I do not want to go into this water. Let me out. Let me out. <clears throat> Hell no. If I can't see further into that pool, I have no business. Wow, this is pretty cool. So it's like, um... It's got some pretty good detail. Like, you got the soggy footsteps. You got the little footprints you leave. Got the buzz, the ambience of the whatever the buzzing noise is, because there's no lights over here. Still is creepy. Uh 
Ha ha ha. I keep expecting something to be here or something to be scare the crap out of me. I mean, I can obviously see when I get closer, but that darkness, not being able to see what's over there, oh, hell no. Okay. Not sure what that is. Is this some kind of a schematic? Like a, a map? Okay. Well, I'm going to pause here for a moment. I'll be back in just a second. I need to use the restroom, otherwise... Uh, can I hide? Is there something in here? Can I hide? Can I crouch? Nope. Can't crouch. <clears throat> Alright, so there's that making that noise. I'm just going to put myself in a corner. I'm going to... Pretend I'm finished and just put myself in a corner. That way I don't see snap. And I'll be back. Alright, and I'm back. To emphasis on what I've done here. <clears throat> one, I hear that, that motion from the corner. Apparently I haven't died. Um, my friends who are Finnish, uh, when we're in VR chat, they seem to do this thing like, oh, I'm going to go AFK, and then they'll just wander over to a corner, and they'll plop down. So, I haven't really seen Americans do this. I don't know if it's a European thing or strictly for Finnish people, but even the people I've just met for the first time who are Finnish, they're like, oh yeah, I'll be right back, and they'll wander off to a corner and just sit down. So, yeah, a little bit of a, I don't know, like I said, if anyone is watching this and knows that it's, you know, and plays VR chat, knows that it's more than just a Finnish behavior... Feel free to comment. So I heard some ambient trick tink trinking or something. I guess it's coming from this ventilation system. Oh, uh, okay. Well, not going that way. <laughs> At least not the first playthrough. I am. I am not like it. <laughs> The ambience is really good. It's definitely tripping me out. I am not going into dark places, only because we all know what happens in those dark places. Ah, oh, at least I want to see what kills me when it comes to happen. <clears throat> and what the hell is this? It's another plastic chair. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, orange slide bad. Orange slide bad. The hell is this? We're we gonna sit here and admire the mural. Interesting. I have no clue what this is about. I'm trying to discern. Whoa! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Wow, okay. Apparently I can do 360 head spins on this chair. <laughs> Good times. Alright. Goes down. Orange slide bad. Oh, boy. The ambience and the visual are really good, though. I mean, as a whole. This is... This is definitely, uh... Aesthetic. Luminal? Liminal? I'm, I can't quite remember what they call it. Oh, God, I can't see the bottom. <clears throat> oh, God, I can't see the bottom. can't jump either. Okay. So we're going to go this way. What the f... You all saw that too, right? That ladder just retracted. Oh, God. Where do 
we do. Okay. That must mean there is something in here with us. Oh god, that's even more unsettling. Wasn't quite sure if there was other footsteps. Are you kidding? <clears throat> oh, hell no. <laughs> In another video, I might actually go down those little things, but... Oh, I can run. Hell yeah. Let's run away. Da, 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 da. Okay. Got the knocked over chair. Can I sit in this one? Oh, I can. I can sit here and admire this lovely chair. Their right mind would wander into these pools. I know there's some Giga Chads out there who probably be like, yeah, challenge accepted. What is this? What is that? Oh, hell no. Hell no. Oh my flipping god. Okay, that's my breathing. Okay, so this is where we just came from. So I thought that was a light. Okay, so that's where I just came from. It circled around into this behemoth of a... Oh my god, that's... That... No. That, I have no idea what that means. <clears throat> Stairs? Okay. Wait a minute. Is up to my chest or my mouth, one of the two. Okay, so this is what I was looking at earlier. So that room connects to this one. Okay. I'm hoping I don't die. Please don't drag me into the water. This isn't too bad. If this was illuminated less, I'd be like, eh, nope. <clears throat> Don't want to be a brave lad and come through here. Watch this crush me. This is going to crush me. I'm going to crunch. Okay, so that's where... Sorry, the ambience. I keep hearing is if someone else. Okay, so that's where that one part was that I didn't want to go through. That connects over here. And these are my footsteps. Wet and squishy. I think I'll go back to the one that says stairs. Ducky? Dude, look at this rubber ducky. Bro. 
you a you a scary looking rubber ducky, and I am not going down there. Hell no. Hopefully that thing ain't gonna follow me. You know what? Was that even there before? I don't remember seeing that because I looked down. Oh man, there's something here following me, isn't it? Oh hell, because I don't. I can swear I'm gonna have to rewatch it when I come back through the playthrough. But I swear that was not there before. Oh my god, and that's where I just came from. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Or not. What was that? What was that? What? Oh, hell no. It's probably in the water. Get the hell out of here. Let's go, bro. One minute after midnight. Oh, I swear, don't go into that, man. Oh my god, it's either. <sighs> Budge. It's gonna force me to go in here, isn't it? Oh my god. Man, this sucks. I can't go back towards the one with the rubber ducky because the rubber ducky one was dark. This one's dark. Ah, uh, let's go. YOLO. Oh my god. I'm gonna die. There's something in the water. There's something in the water gonna kill me. Let's go, bro. Let's go, bro. Let's go swim, walk, run, dive, get to the damn stairs. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Damn. I was like, wait a minute, is this a dead end? Isn't this just where I came from? Oh, it connects. <sighs> I just came from there. All paths lead to this moment. Alright, well. If I don't live. It was nice knowing y'all. I see this as my only part, my my only exit. Whew. One, two, three. Apparently, that's a dead end. Okay. Well, that led to death. <laughs> well, that being said, I guess I'm gonna go in here. I'm a little bit braver now. Um, however, that part can kiss my ass. I'm going the other way. So they have a rewind system. Interesting. All right, rubber ducky time. Let's go say hi to the natives. What's up, rubber ducky? I see my splish splash is still here. You're not going to hurt me, right? Right? Oh, my fucking God. Focus straight. Focus straight. Don't look to your left or right. Focus straight. Focus straight. Focus straight. Focus straight. Oh, my God. Get to the stairs, bro. Get to the stairs, bro. Ah, oh, yeah. We 
somehow managed to survive that. Whew. It's the stairwell that never ends. It goes on and on, my friend. Oh boy. Oh, I thought it was red blood. Blood red, uh... <laughs> I thought it was blood red, um... <clears throat> water. What's up, bro? Okay. See if any of this... I could swear there was a door right here. Nope. Once I have absolutely no other choice. I get the feeling that this is going to be a dead end too, and I will either have to do the side... Oh, you know what? As far as I know, it leads to the bottom. Let's see where it goes. Good animation. Ah. Interesting, but scary. And I have no choice but to go this way. <sighs> I hate this. It's forcing me to confront my fears. I do not like this unknown pool, uh, darkness in the pool. Um, I don't know if anyone else had this problem, but when you're a kid, you have nightmares about that kind of a thing. Like there's something else in the water with you, even though it's just a, a normal swimming pool, there's something else in the water. that I can't see the bottom of the pool is disturbing. Is there something else in the water with us? Nothing. No matter where I go, it's dark. I hate this. This is, um, like I was just uh, mentioning before, this is stuff that we, or at least I did as a kid, dreamed of being in a pool where you couldn't see the bottom and there was always some kind of a monster in it or you had that fear of uh, drowning. It's kind of where I'm going. And it's getting darker. This goes nowhere. Let's pick up the pace. Head towards the light. What is that? The fuck is that? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, hell no. Let's go, let's go, let's go.
<sighs> At least I am semi happy I'm in the light. I know I'm not safe. But that was creepy. That was ah. I need some almond water. I need some almond water to cool my nerves. Is that a diving board? Obviously, I can't reach the diving board. Can I sit here and just chill and... Can I take a breather? Cool. Can I sit in the other one? Yeah! Is it gonna come down for me? No? Damn. Alright, good talk. Anyways. As kids, or at least in my case, um, having nightmares about stuff like this. And that's why I'm thinking there's other people like myself who went, Oh, hey, let's make the back rooms. It can make it a real thing. And that's how some of these levels are probably created. This is cool. This is not cool. What the hell is that? Okay. Alright, Nay. Don't look down. Just cross like it's no big deal. And it's another springboard. You know what? I'm tired of this adventure. Let's just jump right off. YOLO! Here we go, boys! Do we die? Do we live? Ooh. So, that is chapter one. Alright, so we'll dig into this part, second part of chapter two, I guess. I guess this is starting chapter two? from bad to worse. Alright, well. Interesting. Kind of a neat ambient level type of thing. So, yeah, we're going to go back to... level. Hopefully that takes me back to the beginning. Okay, cool. So, uh, I got through chapter one. That kind of confirmed what I was thinking of earlier, where it's like a total of six chapters. Um, I'm pretty sure some of the dark places uh, probably do go into, you know, be there either Easter eggs or they do roundabout into the um, to the to the end game, where it's like everything leads to one, with the exception of the one thing I jumped into. It killed me. It's definitely got a very creepy vibe to it. Obviously, I don't like these luminal spaces. Or liminal, or however you pronounce it. But the ambience, the visuals, everything is really good. I'm definitely looking forward to jumping into the other six. So uh, we'll continue part two in the next uh, video. For now, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, let you all go. And I'll see you in the next uh, next episode. Cheers.